In this series on isosceles triangles, we will explore the isosceles triangles in deep, in detail, try to understand their properties and make them with simple things like newspaper. Isosceles triangles are defined as triangles where two sides are equal. In this case, this side and this side seems to be equal. This angle and this angle also are equal. So the angles opposite the equal sides are also equal. Now the easiest way to make an isosceles triangle with a newspaper is to take this newspaper and fold it in half and you can do it either along the length or along the breadth whichever way you feel like and then you can take this and then you can cut along this fold at an angle from any point to any point from any point on this line to any point on this line let's do that let's say I cut like this In a straight line and what comes out is an isosceles triangle where this side is the same as this side we can also see that because it folds on top of each other and we can also see that the angles are also same because they fold onto each other let's try cutting this paper in some other angle let's say a very steep angle from here what we get is again an isosceles triangle so it doesn't matter which way you, at which angle you cut so long as you cut in a straight line you get an isosceles triangle now we saw that we could make isosceles triangles by folding the newspaper in half either along the length or the breadth but is it required to fold in half not necessarily. Let's see if we can make the isosceles triangle by folding it along the length or the breadth. Not necessarily in half, but along any line, along any point. So I have folded this paper along the width and you can see that I haven't folded it in half. I can still make an isosceles triangle. I have to do the same thing again. I will start from any point and cut along a straight line from any point to any point and what I get is an isosceles triangle because these two sides are same they they sit on top of each other we could make an isosceles triangles by either folding the paper along the length or along the breadth but can we make an isosceles triangle by folding along any line say like this here I have folded the paper in a straight line at any angle and for making an isosceles triangle what I'll do is I will just fold it back along the same line and so what I have now is this line is perpendicular to this line because I fold it on top of it so what I'll do now is cut across this second folded line this is the same situation as we had in the first two cases here again I can cut from any point on this line to any point on this line and I will have and and you can see clearly while this is an isosceles triangle this angle is 90 degrees these two sides of the isosceles triangle sit on top of each other and that's why it's an isosceles triangle